show you is the letter cards and what you're going to do with that. And there's a lot that we're going to do with this. And it needs to be done daily um, and consistently. So you'll get a package of letter cards. They'll have a binder ring on them. Take that binder ring off when you're not, when you're not storing them. That's just to help you keep them organized and stored. You're going to kind of want to mix them up some. I have sent them to you in order, so you'll kind of want to shuffle them up. <clears throat> but then you show your child the card, and they say, C says K. D says D. F says F. And you'll go through all of them like that. Then you're going to go through them again, but this time, your child needs to have that dry erase mat in front of them, and you don't show them the card. You say, um, write D. So they'll write the D, and I like to say doorknob before the door, duh, duh, duh. They love that. Um, write C, write B, 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 baseball bat before the ball, B, B, B. We do things like that. When it comes to Q, U, we don't do just Q because you never see Q all by itself. Q is married to you, and so we always do Q and U together and draw a little heart around it, and they'll teach you about all that. They love it, and I hope that they still remember it. Um, and then after you're done with that, what you're going to want to do is go through and just tell them the sound. Now, this is where I will do something a little different in the videos you'll see every day. We'll be doing this every day in the videos. Um, I'll show them the card, but it's preferable that you don't show them the card so that they... Um, have to learn the sound and the symbol. Um, so you say f, f, and they write an F. You say g, g, and they write a G. You say h, h, and they write an H. You're going to go through all the cards like that too. The next part is um, where you're going to see the blending mat. And the blending mat is included in your packet. I don't have one here because I don't normally use a blending mat, but I sent you a blending mat to keep everything organized and to help you sort of have a place for them to work. Now the blending mat is you just take the cards and you just put them on there. Always put the vowels in the middle, in that middle, middle line on your blending mat, and then put the other letters around it. And so, um, What you do, I'm just going to set some up. I'm not going to set all of them up because it would take forever. But I usually do that while I'm telling them the sounds and then I set it up that way. So what you would do is now we have some of them laid out. So you'll go, all right, let's fingerspell. And they get out their fingerspeller and they go, qu, a, t, quat. Is that a word? No, that's a nonsense word. And so you move on. Now look. Is that a word? Yes, that's a word. We can write that. So you can take a blank spot on your dryer on your blending mat because it is also dry erase, and they can write the word pot, P-O-T. They're going to want to put a macaroni noodle on top of the O because that is how we know that that O is saying it's short vowel sound, is to put a macaroni noodle. So you go through all the letters like that, N, A, T, not, and you just change them however you want to, N, A, S, Nos, not a word. Um, and change out that middle one. Don't forget to change it. Ooh, eh, er, leer. That's not a word. That's not how we spell it. Um, and then sometimes they'll come to this. Ooh, eh, k, lick. Well, that is a word, but is it spelled correctly? No, it's not, because when there's a short vowel sound, the k is always spelled C-K and not K. And your child knows that. And so please reinforce that with them. It, that's a really good lesson for them to, to remember. Um, and that's stuff that we'll be going over in our videos every day. But I just wanted you to have some knowledge of what uh, the letter cards and the blending mat were used for that I've sent to you. And I hope this helps some. As always, I'm here to help you whenever you need me. You know how to get a hold of me. And don't hesitate to call, text, message, whatever.